Hi, a film I caught up with on Friday evening, having wanted to see it for some time, is Nobody, a new film by Elia Neisholler, the director of Hardcore Henry, an action film from a few years ago that I really enjoyed, and written by Derek Kolstad, the creator of the John Wick series. This is very much cut from the same cloth as John Wick. It's basically about an assassin who, leading a quiet life, goes back to murdering lots and lots of Russian gangsters. But the twist this time is who the character is before we see him go back to work. Our main character is a perfectly normal, ordinary man who works for his father-in-law's machining company as an accountant. He's played by Bob Odenkirk, who started out as a sketch comedian, moved into slightly more dramatic fare with Breaking Bad, playing the tongue-in-cheek crooked attorney who helped the main characters, and has since then spun off into his own series, which has wound up gaining him considerable acclaim and reputation as a serious dramatic actor. This is his first action movie. And I've described the film to friends as basically being John Wick, but with Hugh Laurie. Um, as uh, his house is burgled, he decides he's going to track down the, those responsible. And it turns out that they're actually just poor people desperate for money. So he lets them go. But on his way back home on the bus, he gets into a fight with the Russian gangsters, which tips off a whole other storyline and winds up with him going back to work as an auditor, as in the last person you want you to see arriving at your company's front door, someone who basically kills everyone who's there. It's, it's essentially what it is as a very enjoyable, not wildly complex action movie. It's surprisingly brisk, it's under 100 minutes, and I was surprised by how well Odenkirk works as an action star. Um, he's pushing 60, but he looks younger and has the physicality of someone younger, even though his expressions and performance definitely carry the weight of the world. Um, I was very impressed by his work in the film. That said, it is mostly kind of rote action movie stuff. I'm not generally that keen on straight down the line action movies, but this has a degree of wit and humour. Um, the discontinuity between someone like Odenkirk and his character turning into a John Wick killing machine is milked as is his relationship with his father, uh, an FBI agent now living in a retirement home, played by Christopher Lloyd, who it turns out also has his son's taste for mass murdering bad guys. As a Friday night movie with beer and some pizza, it's actually perfect. Um, under the right circumstances, this can be highly enjoyable. And as such, I think I would recommend it.